So, Mr. Inquisitor. President, please be seated. Le Président, veuillez vous asseoir. President, today the Supreme Court Chamber continues its appeal proceedings, la de la Cour and we have a witness that is nous avons avec nous un témoin, SCW3, who is going to testify this morning. Grafje, are all the parties present? Je demande au greffier de faire maintenant son rapport sur la présence des parties à l'audience. Greffier. Le greffier. Monsieur le Président, dans les procédures, toutes les parties sont présentes. Toutes les parties sont présentes. Et Monsieur Nuntier. Vous avez right to be présent dans le cadre de la délivrance 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 Yang Sochit, Yang Sochit, Yana Rumdul, Yana Rumdul, and Paul Dina. Thank you. Paul Dina, so present. Bahaita Jun Jab Chaut Nun Chia Som Sut Lea Bang Men Chow Room Sa Pana Ka Nun Chia Nun Chia Has Where Face Run Le Président However He Participate The Proceedings From A Holding Cell Downstairs Depuis La Cellule Provisoire Based on the medical report of the accused by the duty doctor dated 3rd July 2015, who confirms that the accused Nunchir has back pain and cannot sit for long in the courtroom. And based on the above information and the request to have his rights, by the accused, l'accusé demande donc the à pouvoir suivre Chamber grants him his request to follow the proceedings remotely from a holding cell downstairs. And the AV unit personnel are instructed to link the proceedings to the room downstairs so that the accused uh, can follow it. Le lien entre cette et le Court officer, please assure the witness SCW3, that is some T, into the courtroom. President, Mr. Witness, 
summoned today by the Supreme Court Président. Chamber in the ECCC par la to de la testify and we'd like to ask you some background information. First of all, what is your name and do you have any alias? Comment vous appelez-vous? Avez-vous un surnom? Witness. My name is Sam Seti, alias T. Je m'appelle Sam Seti. Question: When were you born? Quand êtes-vous né? Answer: I was born in 15 of May, 1961. 1961. Question: Where were you born? Question: Et où êtes-vous né? And uh, Mr. Witness, please uh, observe the uh, microphone. Monsieur le témoin, attendre que l'on allume votre And micro. Answer: I was born in a, a village, Je suis a commune, village de Pay, commune de Pay, Pay. district, Kampong Chinang province. Province de Kampong Chinang. Question: In your declaration form, you stated that your district of birth. Dans votre is Kampong Chenang, and now you stated it's a relief ear. Please uh, confirm which one is Nos correct. Nos informations sont que votre district de naissance n'est pas uh, le même que celui que vous avez I was born at a village, a Je suis commune, relief ear district, Kampong Chenang province, dans la and that province is the de correct Chenang one. Et non pas le district de Kampong Chenang. Question, what is your nationality and what is your current occupation? Question. Quelle est votre nationalité et quelle est votre Answer. Réponse. I am Khmer. Je suis Cambodgien. And I am a police inspector et of Kampong Chenang town. Je suis de police pour la municipalité de Kampong Chenang. Question. What is your father's name and Question. is he alive? Comment s'appelle votre père? Est-il toujours en vie? Answer. Réponse. My father Mon is Sam Eun and my Sam mother is Ong Ni. They both deceased. Les deux sont Question, Question: What is your wife's name? Comment s'appelle votre épouse? Answer: My wife's Réponse. name is Pra Sao Ni. Question: Is she alive? Question: Vit-elle toujours? Question: How many children do you have? Question: Combien d'enfants avez-vous? Question: Where is your current address? Question: Quelle est votre adresse actuelle? Answer: Réponse. Currently, I live in Trio oui, Village. Au village de Trio. Trio Village. Street my commune, Rolipi District, Kampong Chenang Province. Please turn on the microphone for Mr. President. President, Le as you related uh, to any of the two accused or any of the two parties? Avec l'un des accusés ou l'une des parties civiles? Answer: No, I don't. Réponse: No. Question: Have you taken an oath before your appearance? Et avez-vous prêté serment? Answer: uh, Yes, I have. Uh, oui, I have taken an oath before the Iron Club statue. La statue à la barre de fer. Question: Have you Question. lodged your application for a civil party before the ECCC? Avez-vous cherché à vous constituer parti civil devant les CETC? Answer: Réponse. I was interviewed by the uh, working group. Le groupe de travail at my workplace, and I made uh, that applica the application at that time. Là que la question. My question. question to you is whether you applied Donc, as a si civil party in any of the cases uh, before the ECCC. Answer: Réponse. I did not know about uh, the case or the application that I made uh, with the working group. Je ne sais question, pas quelle est la demande does it mean that you 
So far, I have not applied as a civil party in any other cases before the ECCC. Is that correct? Vous constituez comme parti civil? And sir, I actually uh, told the working groups that I can be a witness in a case before the ECCC. President, I lie now to inform you of your rights and obligations as a witness. Do you have the right not to respond or to make any comments that lead to self-incrimination? However, you must respond to questions except for questions or statements that incriminate you. And you must tell the truth based on what you know, heard, saw. Je remember vous savez, de ce que vous avez vu, entendu, vécu, observed firsthand ce dont vous vous souvenez. The events relating to the questions. De tout événement dont vous avez souvenir, donc en rapport avec cette question posée. Euh, so question. You said uh, you provided an interview with a working group. Uh, which vous working group uh, are you referring to? Vous êtes entretenu avec un groupe de travail, mais de quel groupe de travail parlez-vous? And uh, I was interviewed by a, a working group. Un groupe de travail m'a interviewé. Whose uh, role was to Locate witnesses of crimes uh, during the Khmer Rouge regime. Des témoins, uh, des crimes Question. Le régime Khmer Rouge. Did, the, did that working group to make a written statement of uh, your interview or whether they only went to your location to identify you as a witness? Se sont-ils simplement déplacés à votre lieu? And so uh, uh, vous interviewer the work group actually oui. interviewed me for the purpose of uh, having me testify before the chamber. En vue de ma déposition. Pl please turn on the president's microphone. Question. Question. So, can I clarify this matter that you were interviewed by uh, the work group and Donc, you provided your statement in that interview? Does it mean you were interviewed by investigators of the office of the co investigating judges? Please answer again so that your voice will go through the interpretation system. Answer I was interviewed uh, by a work group who were searching for witnesses. Un groupe de travail à la recherche de témoins s'est entretenu avec Question. Question. Have you appeared before the trial chamber at the ECCC? Avez-vous comparu devant la chambre de première instance des CETC? Answer, uh, no, I non. haven't. President, thank you. Le président. The chamber would like Merci. to hand the floor now to la the co-counsel for Nunji Defense. Defense. You may proceed, counsel. La parole, maître. Um, thank you very much, Mr. President. Uh, good morning. Good morning, Your Honours. Good morning, Council. Um, good morning, Mr. Witness. Um, I have a few questions for you uh, this morning. Um, do you remember when it was that you were interviewed? Do you remember when it was that you were interviewed? Mr. Witness, uh, 
Do you listen to the Akmai channel on your headphone? Témoin, entendez-vous l'interprétation Akmai dans vos écouteurs? President, uh, Council, you may continue. Thank you, uh, Mr. President. Um, did I hear correctly? You said that you gave a statement one year ago? Yes, it was a little bit uh, more than a year ago. And where, where did you give this statement one year ago? With us. I provided my statement at uh, my police office, that is at uh, the police office in uh, Kampong Chenang uh, town. The police in the chef lieu of Kampong Chenang. So that was 2014. Am I correct to understand that? 2014, when you gave a statement. Bad. Yes. We. Come try. That is correct. Exact. Um, Mr. President, again, I'm a bit confused. Um, what I have in front of me is a statement which dates about seven years ago. Um, I'm also looking at the prosecution while I'm talking. Um, and I would be very happy to know if there is a second statement. Um, Thank you. Good morning, Your Honors Council. Uh, as far as we know, there's no second statement, and I think it would be very quick resolved by showing the attachment to the statement and asking the witness if he's if this was part of his statement which apparently was drawn and signed I will move on uh, mr. witness did you make did you give a statement to investigators of the investigating judge seven years ago as well I provided my statements to the work group and I provided them a description of uh, my experience through the regime of uh, three years, eight months and uh, 20 days. Um, Mr. President, with your leave, I would like to show the witness um, uh, the Khmer version of his uh, WRI uh, and would like to ask the witness if he recognizes his, uh, his signature on that document. Uh, 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 I don't think it is now time uh, to uh, show him the written record of statement. I'd like to first put some questions for clarification to the witness. And Mr. Witness, please uh, inform the chamber how many times have you been interviewed by the work groups from the ECCC or the Khmer Rouge Tribunal? Answer to my recollection, I was interviewed only once. Questioned. Question. So, if you were interviewed for only one time, please try to recall how long ago was it? You 
Just mention that uh, it was last year, vous venez de dire and this year it's 2015, and you said it was last year, you referred to 2014. But I think the word uh, last year or previous year Mais could be interpreted based on the uh, region. Peut de la region. So please try to recall how long ago, how many years ago oui, vous donc you dire, were interviewed. Il y a combien d'années? It was almost two years ago. Réponse. C'était il y a presque deux ans. That I provided my interview. President, defense counsel, you uh, can. Maître. putting uh, questions to the witness. And I think you want to uh, show the document témoin, to je... the witness in order to uh, clear uh, the timeline. Uh, yes, Mr. President, I only would like to show his signature, not, of course, the content of uh, the statement. <coughs> so, Mr. Witness, if you would be so kind to have a look at the last page and the page before. National Deputy Co-Prosecutor, Mr. President, for the proper uh, record of the transcript, the document given to the witness uh, is that the document in the Khmer uh, language does not bear the signature of uh, the witness. However, it bears the thumbprint of the witness. So for that reason, I would uh, request Mr. President to ask the counsel to clarify this matter with the witness. President, I think the Khmer document is now before the witness. And Mr. Witness, uh, please. Uh, Provide us uh, your impression of the document before you. Le témoin a le document sous les yeux. Witness, the thumbprint and the hand le writing underneath la are mine. Both the thumbprint and the handwriting, I mean. Mr. Witness, um, would you also be so kind to have a look at the very uh, first sentences on the first page? Um, there it says you were interviewed. Um, seven years ago, at um, 7 August 2008. Is that correct? That's exact. No, it was not uh, seven years ago. No. It was actually two years ago that I was interviewed. I acknowledge the document and the signature on it was made when I was uh, interviewed. Um, uh, maybe a peculiar question. Um, you are a police inspector, uh, Mr. Witness, so there can be no doubt in your mind that you were interviewed only two years ago and not seven years ago, as this document seems to indicate. First, the interview was not conducted seven years ago. It was only conducted about two years ago. And I don't agree with you that I was interviewed seven years ago. Um, 
it's highly problematic. Um, La défense, oui, mais ça pose problème. Do you remember speaking to someone um, who interviewed vous -vous parlé you avec and recorded qui... your interview and then something went wrong vous, with the battery uh, of the recording machine? Does that ring a bell to you? Does that ring a I was interviewed. But I was not uh, aware of uh, the details of the equipment used during the interview. For example, I don't know whether the recorder was out of battery. Um, Mr. Witness, you recognize your signature. Do you remember being read? the content of this document. Vous vous -vous si on vous a lu le de ce document. Ben. Réponse. After I was interviewed, I actually reviewed uh, the uh, written Après record lu and uh, it was uh, consistent. However, I have not read it for. Uh, I have not read it since. Mais je ne pas lu depuis. For that reason, I cannot recall the uh, details bon. of uh, what I stated in this document. Though I believe that it is consistent with what I told the uh, work group Mais at the time during the interview. Were you? Uh, were you given a copy? Um, and if yes, where are, did, did, did you keep it somewhere uh, in your house or at the police station? Did you keep it chez vous, le cas échéant, ou peut-être au poste de police? I received a copy uh, from the World Group. I actually reviewed it and I read it uh, a couple of times. However, it's been uh, a few years now. And only now that I've been summoned, though I have not read it uh, recently. However, I can recall most of what I said uh, without having to refer to the written uh, statement. Relire, je me de, um, um, de my last question on this subject before I will move on to the content, uh, but are you bon, question, insisting uh, that the interview was donc, a year ago, maybe two years ago, and it wasn't seven years ago? That is something that you, um, that you insist to. Is that, is that correct? Vous insistez sur ce fait. Yes, I can confirm that oui, it confirme took place about two years ago. Deux ans um, for the record, Mr. President, Mr. I've just been informed that the document creation date of la date de um, de ce document, this document is 1st of October 2013, strangely enough. I'll leave it now because of time reasons. Um, I will move on to the content. Bonjour, Monsieur le Président. Je ne veux pas interrompre indûment mon confrère. I don't wish, Mr. President, to interrupt Mais simplement pour le PV d'audience, j'ai un document en français, donc le PV d'audition du témoin, a, uh, qui est porteur d'un tampon de réception par le tribunal en date du 20 juin 2009. Janvier, pardon. 20 janvier 2009, January, date de réception par le tribunal du PV d'audition. Um, thank you, Madam um, Civil Party Lawyer. We will Merci, get back to this, but now, uh, Mr. President, I would like to move to the content of the case because of time reasons. Mr. Witness, um, would you 
Um, could you remember, or do you remember, uh, what happened on the 17th April 1975? Vous souvenez-vous de ce qui s'est produit le 17 avril 1975? I am one of the victims of the regime which lasted for three Je years, suis une eight des months, and twenty days. Trois ans, huit mois et I was jours. forced to to vacate my house to a mountainous area. Ma maison pour and aller dans une montagne. upon reaching what Gerard Knight Pagoda, et à mon arrivée à la I pagode de Park an announcement that former Public servants, Il a été annoncé soldiers, que les anciens soldats et fonctionnaires et les étudiants pouvaient aller et qu'ils pouvaient recevoir uh, du riz et pourraient ensuite retourner à leur lieu de travail. Let, let me take you back in time. Um, 17 April 1975, um, where were you living and what happened on that day to you and your family? 17 avril 1975, où habitiez-vous et vous décrire ce qui est arrivé à votre famille et à vous. C'était en 1975 que j'ai évacué à une montagne montagne, comme je l'ai dit. Coopérative. We were told to register our name so that we could get uh, some rice and that we would be allowed to return to the province and uh, to return to work at our previous uh, position. And after those people uh, obtained uh, rice, they were taken away and killed. They were all killed. Um, please listen uh, to my questions, Mr. Witness. Um, 17 April 75. What happened in the first week between 17 April and 24 April 75? Where were you? Where was your family? Where were you going to? Where were you walking in those first seven days? Que faisiez-vous pendant ces sept jours? I Réponse. walked on foot at the time. J'ai marché. People were evacuated and they were ordered to leave their house. Les habitants ont été évacués. And they had to follow the direction as instructed. Otherwise, les instructions. we would be risking lives when the U.S. Uh, planes would uh, bombard the area. So for that reason, we packed our belongings and food supply and left. Um, did, your, did you Question. and your father and mother leave together with your siblings? Votre mère, votre père, ainsi que votre fratrie, êtes-vous tous partis en même temps? But my family comprised of my parents and four younger siblings. My family, my parents, parents and two of my younger siblings were killed. One of my younger siblings was a teacher. He and his entire family members were killed. Lui et At sa that time, I was 14 or 15 years, ago, years old, and I uh, pretended to, to be dead amongst the corpses of uh, members of seven families. Des de sept the familles. seven family members were ordered to sit in one group, and they fired others to kill us all. Mr. Witness, please bear with me. Um, I'm, I'm asking you questions about um, you and your siblings and your father and mother leaving. Um, I will get to whatever happened after what Chuck said later. So please tell me where you walked, uh, where you arrived, how long did you and your family walk 
um, from Pe Pe village. Par rapport au village de Please Pe be mindful of the chronology. Faites bien attention au micro, s'il vous plaît. Et la chronologie. I left a village. Réponse. J'ai quitté le village de Pei. And arrived at Wat Srosnaya Pagoda. Je suis arrivé à la pagode de Wat Srosnaya. How many days did it take you to arrive um, Question. at Wat Srosnaya Wat Srosnaya Pagoda? Combien de jours How, how many days did, you, did it take you Combien de jours pour vous êtes pris pour pas venir à la pagode de Srosnaya? Bah. Answer. Réponse. It's, I was traveling on the way to Chiroz Dutch. Je and me suis rendu à la pagode de Strax We could move uh, very slowly. After we reached uh, the nous mountain avons avancé très lentement area, we could une reach fois que nous sommes arrivés dans la zone montagneuse, Chiroz Dutch Pagoda, nous it took us about 10 days to arrive at that pagoda. Au total, pagoda. Uh, cela nous a pris quelques 10 jours. Uh, on the way uh, from Pe'e village to Wat Strax Sadek, did you stop in a village Uh, Avez-vous fait halte Klong Popok? dans le village de Krompopok? Witness. Réponse. Je n'ai pas fait halte dans le village de Krompopok. Je n'ai pas fait halte dans le village de Krompopok. Je n'ai pas fait halte dans le village de Krompopok. Beaucoup de gens étaient en route, nous ne pouvions And, uh, we could, uh, parcourir travel uh, only half kilometer or one kilometer qu'un demi-kilomètre ou un kilomètre par jour morning. et non pas trois ou quatre. Un demi-kilomètre ou un kilomètre par matinée peut-être. Il fallait nous suivre les uns les autres. Was, uh, Il n'y a pas que ma famille family qui members, se déplaçait à ce uh, Beaucoup d'autres gens voyageaient avec nous. Um, Please, Mr. Witness, question. listen to my questions. Monsieur le témoin, s'il vous plaît, écoutez um, mes give questions. Brief answers. Did you and your family stop on the way in Klongpok? Votre famille et vous-même avez-vous um, fait halte dans le village de Klongpok? Down the road. Did you stop there? Vous êtes-vous arrêté là-bas, dans ce village? But, mien chop na. Answer: Yes, we oui. made. Stop at, uh, Nous avons fait halte Klong Popok Pagoda dans la pagode de Klong Popok pendant uh, le lunch time. And then subsequently, Alors, du déjeuner. is it correct you went to Phnom Chung Rai in Samaki Min Chi district? Is that correct? Dans le district de Chiri, est-ce exact? Answer yes. Réponse oui. We left Klong Popong Pagoda and arrived at Chumriye uh, Mountain Chumrie. in Samaki Mienche District. We were on the peak of the mountain at that time. Nous sommes arrivés au sommet de la montagne de Thank Chumrie. you. And did you then subsequently go southward um, Question. Et vous to vous Phnom Chumriye uh, and then Chumrie. to what? No, Phnom Phnom Chumrie. Chumrie. Subsequently. Avant d'arriver à Chak Sedek. Answer. After we reached Chumrie Pagoda, we had to move downhill so that uh, we could be placed in cooperatives. After I left uh, Chumrie Mountain, I uh, was on the way to Chirok Pagoda. Could you give us an estimate how, my, how many days it took you from the A village? Um, to reach Wat Shrak Sedek. How many days in total? Combien de jours se sont écoulés? Answer. I could not give you the exact estimate. Réponse. Je ne peux pas vous donner de chiffres précis. As far as I can tell you. 
I can say it took us 10 days uh, to reach uh, jobs like Pagoda. Um, when you reached um, what, what Chirac Sedek, um, what did you see? What do you recall after having arrived? Uh, what did you see? What did you experience? Answer. After, upon my arrival at Chirac uh, Pagoda, I ran out of rice to eat. I had no more food supplies. Je n'avais plus rien à manger. And at that time, the one committee of the three month, three year, eight months, and twenty day regime, du régime des trois ans, huit mois announced et that jours uh, we could uh, get rise after we reached uh, our name, and uh, everyone could go back to work in our own previous position. Um, Mr. Witness, you were 14 at the time. Um, Monsieur le témoin, vous you were 14 ans with your father and mother and your sis young, younger sisters. Uh, what did your father and mother do? Um, what do you recall seeing once you had arrived at Batshrak um, Sedek? Can you be more specific, please? Witness, thank you. In the written record, I gave Réponse. my answer once already, but I did not need. I do not need to refer to the written record. I witnessed the Mais incident at that time, document. and I would like to spend a little bit more time to explain to you. Cela, After I got the rice, it was passé. around one o'clock. And Et we were led to our own cooperatives. Ensuite, After we got the rights, we were moved to cooperatives. Nous avons After reçu we arrived at Prey Urungkla, we traveled from one, we started leaving Prey Urungkla at one o'clock. En fait, nous avons quitté Prey Lumkla after we uh, reach uh, Prey Lumkla, uh, we reach uh, north of nous nous one place, vers le nord. and we put our belonging at another end of uh, a river. When we reach uh, that place, there were armed forces. We were asked to sit in uh, one group, and uh, those soldiers. Uh, shot their rifles at all of us, Et and as for the baby, uh, the baby was hanged by uh, its leg, and uh, it, wa it was killed. And the cops and bodies uh, were thrown into pits, covered with leaves. And after they did such acts, the uh, soldiers uh, left the place. Après quoi, les and sont at partis. that time, I uh, did not die, and I was. Uh, Moi, je pas mort. And you know, an adult at that time, and I pretended uh, to be dead. Je pas I mort was adulte, pulled and thrown malade, into mort, the pardon. pit covered with a tree leaves. And during that autres. time, it was raining. After they et left the pits, I. Crawl up. I crawl out partie, of the pit. Je suis sorti de la fosse. And uh, four people survived the period. Quatre some uh, got injured on uh, the head, and some got uh, broken ribs. I could not help them. There were four surviving people at that time, and we went. And we left uh, the pit to get together. Nous sommes sortis de la fosse we ensemble. were walking toward uh, Chirostat uh, Pagoda. Nous sommes allés and when we arrived at the Pagoda, lorsque nous sommes arrivés à cette pagode, there were relatives and uh, neighbors who saw, the des voisins, saw me and uh, knew that I was I had been led to the pits to be killed, and uh, I was vu, helped by them. These people knew that uh, my uh, 
parents had been killed already. Mes parents avaient déjà and during that time, the, the guards uh, tried to search for for us, four of us who survived uh, the killing. Les gardes étaient à notre poursuite. Ils and in les quatre personnes the qui evening, the four, the, the, the members of the armed force uh, went to different places. Le soir, les forces armées se sont dispersées. And uh, people at that time uh, tried to uh, go to the places that uh, they wanted, and les gens the militia men could not control the situation at that time, and uh, we left in groups. Nous sommes tous partis par petits groupes. Um, Mr. Witness, please. Um, I'm still Question. Um, in, in the chronology when you and your family arrived at the Vat Shrak Sedek. What did you see? Did you see thousands of people? Um, de respecter la hundreds chronologie. of people. What did you see Lorsque when you arrived there? Avez-vous vu des dizaines de personnes, des centaines de personnes? Qu'avez-vous vu exactement? Bye. Answer. Chiroz Dajat Pagoda was the place where members of uh, Pol Pot uh, gathered together. Les gens de Pol Pot As se I sont réunis à la pagode earlier, de Shrak Some people uh, were cyclo driver, but uh, in order to get the rice, they uh, registered that uh, they were former soldiers. Chiroz Dajat Pagoda was the place where all people were pour obtenir du riz, il fallait put together. Mr. President, I'm, I'm seeking your assistance. Uh, could you please instruct uh, the witness to give short answers and answer my questions? Um, I'm unable, it seems, uh, to, uh, to, to convince the witness to answer my questions. Um, Mr. Witness, what did you see uh, at Monsieur um, le témoin, qu'avez-vous vu à la pagode de Shrak Sedek um, À quelle heure y êtes like? Please Quelle était la situation là-bas Je vous en prie, contentez-vous de dire ce que vous avez vu là-bas. Council, uh, your, excuse me, your honors, it might be helpful for counsel to specify which of the occasions that the witness arrived at that pagoda he's asking a question about because the witness said that the family arrived and then after this incident in, in the forest they went back there so it will be much clearer on the record if counsel specifies which of the occasions he's asking about i think i was very clear mr president je pense avoir été suffisamment clair monsieur le président le président counsel please Monsieur l'avocat de la défense, veuillez poser des direct questions directes et concises. Witness. And Mr. Witness, you et are instructed to pay attention uh, to the specific questions question and short que questions put by the defense team. And please give your short answer. You may now resume your line question, Mr. Counsel. Thank you, Mr. President. You were, let me take you back. You were Phnom Chumre. Then you and your family went to Wat Shrak Sedek. What did you see, Ensuite, what did you hear when you Shrek arrived Sedek. there for the first time? Mais j'aimerais savoir ce que vous avez vu à cette pagode lorsque vous êtes arrivé pour la première fois. Answer. Uh, when I reached Chiroz Daj Pagoda, Réponse. I saw many, lorsque many people. Lorsque je suis arrivé à la pagode de Shrek Sedek, il y avait beaucoup, beaucoup de gens. I saw member of uh, Pol Pot Armed Force there. J'ai vu des membres de Did you see in fact thousands of families there? Maître Copé, y avez-vous vu des milliers de familles? But answer. Réponse. What I can say is that there were many thousands of people. Il y avait des milliers de Then what happened? Um, Please explain Question. what happened that day that you arrived and the next day. Vous pouvez expliquer ce qui s'est passé le jour de votre arrivée et le lendemain. Patient. Upon my arrival, réponse. 
there was an announcement. Une annonce a été faite à mon arrivée. That uh, they wanted to search for the uh, former civil servant, civil servant, so that uh, they could go back to work. Les anciens fonctionnaires pour qu'ils reprennent leur poste. Um, then what happened? Question. Et que s'est-il passé ensuite? Answer. I told you Réponse. earlier, and after they registered the Je names to dit, obtain rights, uh, these people were taken away and killed. Uh, Mr. Witness, you just testified Question. that there were thousands of Monsieur people and there was an announcement. Um, um, what happened exactly? Um, did they sit down at tables, people registered, Des gave their biographies? Assis, How did um, Khmer Rouge soldiers tables, verify that people were in fact or no officials? Please tell us in, details, in detail what happened that day. Pourriez-vous nous dire ce qui s'est passé concrètement? Answer. On that day, there was a loudspeaker. Réponse. An announcement was made Ce over the loudspeaker to search for former soldiers and uh, civil servants. And the announcement was aimed to uh, search for uh, former officials and officers so that uh, they could uh, get a rise. And uh, while the announcement was being made, the names of people were registered in the list. And uh, we, uh, were, uh, they told lies to all of us that uh, we could go back to work. Let me ask it differently. Um, you and your family heard that announcement. What did your father do? Answer. Réponse. My parents uh, registered their names so that uh, they could obtain rights. Was your father, Question. in fact, a former Lonol Republic père official? Était-il un ancien fonctionnaire de la République de Lonol? Answer. During Lonol time, he was uh, a soldier. Il était soldat sous le régime de Lonol. Did he, when he registered himself, um, write down his name and his uh, occupation? Was he a soldier? A-t-il inscrit son nom et son profe sa profession? A-t-il indiqué qu'il était soldat? Answer. Réponse. He registered that he was a former soldier. Il a indiqué qu'il était un ancien soldat. Um, did he Question. tell you anything about the forms that he had to write? Did he Vous say anything about uh, how long it took dit, for the, the officials to verify that he had indeed Vous been a soldier? What happened, what happened next? Avait été nécessaire pour les responsables pour qu'ils puissent vérifier ce qu'il en était de son ancien poste. Que vous a-t-il dit exactement Answer. After the registration. Réponse. And uh, names of members of family uh, were called, and uh, we were let uh, southward of the pagoda, and we were told that we go to find a house to live in. Um, I'm still Question. around the moment that your father registered himself. He said that he had been a soldier, according to you. Um, vous, how do you know? Did he tell you this? Or did he uh, tell you um, what exactly he wrote down? Did you hear it from someone? Please explain. Nous vous plaît? Answer. He did not put anything else other than it. 
that he was a former soldier. The announcement was aimed to search for former soldiers so that uh, these soldiers could obtain rights. So he listed as a former soldier. And how long did it take? The, uh, how long did the registration take? There were thousands of people. How many people did, in fact, um, if you know, register as soldiers? But answer. Réponse. I did not know how many days it took to finish the registration. And as I told you, there were many people in the pagoda and in uh, the dining pagode. hall. The dining hall was about three meters uh, above the ground and rice uh, uh, was kept in that le dining hall and after uh, people got rice they left the place. Did your father wear Arte. military gear uh, identifying him as a lone old soldier at that day or since the liberation? Question. Votre père portait-il un uniforme, des vêtements qui auraient pu montrer qu'il était un ancien soldat ce jour-là? But Réponse. answer, he wore uh, paramil uh, paramilitary uh, trousers uh, with Il a white shirt. Et un, une and how long did Question. it subsequently last between the moment of registration Combien and you temps entre and your parents and inscrit, sisters and siblings leaving the pagoda? vos frères et sœurs et vous-même avez quitté la pagode. But answer after we obtained the rights and after the Réponse. registration we were led away Une we were que nous nous let us south words demandé de nous diriger vers le sud de, de la pagode. And uh, we were told that uh, we would go to uh, find houses to non, live in, but actually they were all killed. Mais en fait, tout le monde a été tué. You said uh, you went southwards, Question. and in your statement you said you went southward to um, Prey Long Cla. Is that correct? Sud et vers Prey Long Cla. Est-ce exact? Bad am tragai. Answer yes, Réponse. that is correct. Oui, c'est exact. Um, isn't it correct, Mr. Witness, that Prey Rong Kla is in fact 70 kilometers northward? Est-il exact, Monsieur le témoin, que Prey Rong Kla se trouve à 17 kilomètres au nord? Answer. It was not a... Uh, Seven uh, kilometers away from the pagoda, it was about two kilometers away uh, from the pagoda. pagoda. It, two, it was to the south de of the pagoda, pagoda not north. Vers le sud de la pagoda. Uh, something went wrong in translation. I said seven zero, seventy kilometers northward. And there's only one prey pre rong kla in um, Cambodia that's seventy kilometers northward. Moi, um, is that correct, Mr. Answer, no, not correct. Réponse, non, In terms ce of pas exact. Uh, the direction and uh, the distance, I told you already that ni after distance, people got the right, they were let southward. Uh, and uh, uh, it was two kilometers away from the pagoda. I mean, the Je parle de Prey Rong Kla, qui est à 2 km de la pagode. There is a Rong Kla village, which Question. is 24 km northeast. Uh, but I'm sure you don't mean this. Um, Mr. Witness, you are a police village. inspector. You grew up in Kampong Chenang. Um, do you disagree that Prey Rong Kla uh, is 70 km uh, north of Wat Shrak Sadek? But mantram Answer no, not correct. Réponse non, ce n'est pas exact. 
Um, fine. Um, Question. Bien. So you and the, your family left um, what Shrak Sedek. Tell me what happened. Une fois que vous avez quitté la pagode de Shrak Sedek avec votre famille, pourriez-vous nous dire ce qui est arrivé? Answer. After we left Shrak Sedek pagoda, we nous avons quitté la pagode de Shrak Sedek. A stream or a river, and nous we avons franchi une rivière to leave. un cours d'eau. Our belongings Et l'on nous a demandé de laisser nos effets personnels de l'autre côté de la rivière, and plus au sud, the northern part, rather. ou plutôt plus and au nord. Nous avons franchi ce cours d'eau en nous dirigeant vers and le sud. Nous avons franchi ce cours d'eau en nous dirigeant vers le sud. We crossed uh, the stream or river. Uh, the armed force uh, took us away and killed. Une fois que nous avons franchi ce cours d'eau, les forces armées se sont emparées de nous pour nous exécuter. What happened exactly? Uh, you were there. You were walking with how many people? Vous étiez là-bas. Combien de gens y avait-il avec vous? Réponse. Generalis. Speaking, the people who were with me at that time were my relatives, uh, seven family members. Les gens qui étaient avec moi étaient des proches, des parents. Seven des families sept. or seven family members. Question: Et qui étaient ces sept membres de votre famille? Réponse. Witness. There were about seven uh, family members in one family, and at that time there were seven families. Il y avait sept familles et environ sept membres and, par famille. And after they were killed, uh, the the pits were full of uh, dead bodies, almost full. Les fosses étaient pleines de cadavres. Again, pleines please de cadavres. do not go too fast. You were walking with how many people in total, uh, going southward, to in you what you say direction, Prairong uh, Klai. Avec combien de personnes vous vous êtes acheminé vers Prairong Klai? Answer. I went with my Réponse. relatives. Je suis parti avec of mes my proches. parents. There were seven mes families, parents. and I could not recall all the names. Familles, mais je ne me souviens pas des noms de tout le monde. I wasn't asking about the question. names, uh, Mr. Williams. I'm just asking you how many, with how many people were you? How big was the group? What happened? Combien de personnes composaient votre groupe? Et je vous demandais également ce qui s'est passé. And so I Réponse. cannot tell you the exact figures. Je ne peux pas vous de Some exact. families had uh, five members. Je Some uh, other families member had uh, ten or twelve members. Que en 10 ou 12. So there were seven families at that time, Au and total, members of the seven families uh, were all killed in the one specific place. Fine, I'll move on. Uh, you were walking Merci, with this group of seven families. Then what happened? membres de, de ces familles, et ensuite, que s'est-il passé? Nothing happened. Because they were all killed, and I uh, surviving the killing. There were four of us survived the killing, and uh, two of my relatives, uh, one male and one female, survived the killing, and uh, my two siblings also survived the killing. So one uh, sister and one brother. Um, Mr. Witness. Your occupation, your occupation is a police inspector. You know that I'm asking you about details. So I'm telling you, please try to re recall what happened. You were walking there with a group of seven families. Then what happened? What did you see? What did you hear? Please give me some details. Answer. 
when course. we were traveling, there were soldiers, armed soldiers. And after we crossed the stream or the river, uh, we were escorted by uh, these armed force uh, soldiers, these armed soldiers, and into uh, the uh, caves of Prey Runkla, and uh, we were all killed. Um, at one point, you say you saw armed soldiers. What did they say? Uh, what did they do? Um, please explain to the court the moment that this group saw these soldiers. What happened? What happened? When we were walked at gunpoint by the group, we were told to Alors, keep going straight accompagnés. and uh, try not to escape, otherwise we would be shot. Droit, then at a signal occasion, we were all ordered to sit as one feu. group, all the seven families. What was the reaction of the people in the group? What happened? Um, gens dans le groupe, que was there a discussion between your father and the soldiers, une discussion what happened? Père et, et les soldats. Que passé? There was no discussion at all. Non, a pas eu de discussion. We were not armed. We did not even have an axe or nous a nous knife. Armés, we were ordered to place our belonging in a pouch on the north effets. side of the stream and we were Dans told to nord, walk sur, across the stream to the south side ensuite, and then on the south side when we arrived we were uh, ordered to walk at gunpoint to the sud, killing site. Um, your father was a soldier you said, um, the other men in the group, were they former Lonol soldiers as well? From uh, my recollection, one family had a member who was a civilian uh, medic, and another family had a member Le who was a teacher. As for the rest civil. of the families, uh, they had at least a member who was a soldier. Les autres, uh, uh, so then you were escorted soldats. by these soldiers um, on, at gunpoint, you say. Donc, um, you were walking across the stream. Then what happened? When we were ordered to sit uh, as a group, On nous a dit de nous asseoir, they stepped back and then they all fired upon us. Et ils ont and for the uh, young children who dessus. were not uh, hit by bullets, Et they would go around, eux, pick them up and smash them. Pas été now in your statement balles, um, that we have before us, you said that you that the, the men in the group were first separated um, and that they came back later. Um, is that correct or is that incorrect? But it is uh, my conclusion there was more than one group who were divided to kill people. For example, one group was assigned uh, to kill uh, my family members and relatives, and other groups will be assigned to other families who received rise from the organization. I'm not interested, Mr. Wittes, uh, in your conclusions, but I'm asking you, um, was the group together when you were being shot at, or had the group been divided into the men and women first, as you uh, testified earlier?
Yes, indeed. First, réponse. Oui, effectivement. They ordered uh, us to divide into uh, groups. Namely, men would be put in one group, and that they had to cross the stream first. Then the wives and the children would follow. And did the men in the group uh, obey this instruction? What, what, what was told uh, to them? What, what exactly happened? What were the words of the soldiers giving this order? At that point in time, I was a young boy, and I followed my father. As I was told that uh, they told my father to cross the stream in order to cut trees to make our uh, makeshift shelter. And the rest of my siblings and my mother was at the other side of the stream. Then I saw those armed uh, soldiers came with uh, their weapon drawn and pointed at uh, my father and other men and took them away. And since I was young, they chased me away to, to return. So I returned to tell my mother and my uncles and aunts that my father and the men were taken away to be shot dead. They did not believe me. Ils ne pas cru. After they had killed the men's group, they returned uh, for the hommes, female group and femmes. the children, et and they were taken to be executed at ils the same spot. Did the Question. soldiers, the Khmer Rouge soldiers, uh, see you uh, following the group of men? Did they say something to you? Can you shed some light on this? Pouvez-vous préciser? Bad. Réponse. First, they divided us into uh, different groups. For example, uh, males uh, uh, grouped and females grouped. Les hommes et les femmes. And in fact, the person who led the men's group crossing the stream was not armed with a rifle or weapon, but uh, armed with a knife, le a long knife. When I saw that, I ran back to tell my uh, mother and my aunts that uh, they, ensuite, moi, je suis allé the, dire my father temps, and the men were taken away and killed. Et les hommes avaient été emmenés and after they tuer. had killed the men's group, the militia, that militia militia came back to uh, get the a female group, including myself, to cross the stream to the other side. I'm not sure if I follow. Um, um, Mr. Mr. President, um, I'm mindful of the time, but this witness, uh, at least in my perspective, is so evasive um, in answering questions. Um, I would um, really like to have some additional time questioning this witness. Your Honor, first of all, we heartily disagree that this witness has been invasive at all. He's telling his story. The questions that are put to him are often compound and complicated, but we have no objection to giving counsel more time. Uh, it doesn't hurt us at all. May, we don't object. President, the chamber noticed that the response from the witness is uh, clear enough. La However, est que les du uh, sont it is clairs. the chamber's observation that uh, some of your questions are repetitive in its nature, do we bear with that? So please try to make your questions Je more precise prie, and to the point. We uh, decide to grant you at an additional time of 10 minutes, 10 minutes so please uh, proceed. I don't think that's very fair, Mr. President. Um, I'm not asking 
any repetitive questions. I'm trying to find the details. Uh, it is our position he's making up this story. And uh, the only way to establish this is to find uh, details that are convincing. But I'll move on. Um, Mr. President, uh, it's, it's, it's the way it is. Um, Mr. Witness, at one point, um, you were being shot at. What happened then? On vous a tiré dessus. Que s'est-il passé? But, Croppy kept buying some lap, but the next young man buying them all. After buying some lap, all the shots at us, and not only to myself, but to many people, and I pretended to be dead. Then we were dragged into the pit, that is including other corpses and myself. Tell me how you did that, playing that. L'interprète a raté le début de la question de Maître Cope. Uh, try to answer to the point. The question is, how did you pretend to be dead? So please answer that question. Witness, yes, I'll, I'll do that. My mother was sitting in front of me, and when they shot at us, one bullet hit her, her chest, so she fell onto the ground, and I pretended to fall onto the ground as well, behind her. So everybody then fell on the ground, and they would go around and smack the heads of young infants to make sure they died. Do you know how your sister and your two young siblings pretended to be dead as well? Et vos votre sœur, votre frère, ont-ils fait semblant d'être morts également? Bad net. Réponse. Some became unconscious while others pretended to be dead, and uh, my two cousins pretended to be dead, but my younger sister was hit at the rear of her uh, head, and there was a blood stain there. And how, li how long did the four of you pretend to be dead? Pendant combien de temps avez-vous, vous quatre, fait semblant d'être mort? While they were going on a killing spree, it did not last that long because it was almost 5 o'clock in the afternoon. Let's say it was 5 o'clock in the afternoon and it was about to rain. So by the time the process uh, continued, it was almost dark. And they hurried to drag us and drop us into the pit. Then they left. Then I called to my relatives if anyone was alive. So then we crawled out of the pit and there were four of us together who survived. And how, li how long did the pretending of you and your siblings um, pretending to be dead last? How long did you play dead? Hours, one hour, thirty minutes. Pendant des heures, pendant une heure, pendant une demi-heure. But you. Réponse. I think it took quite a while. Un certain temps. Maybe about two hours by the time the killing spree started, and by the time they we made sure that they had all left. Le moment où nous nous étions certains qu'ils étaient partis, c'est là que nous sommes sortis de la fosse. Do you have a question? Can you explain um, how you and your younger sister and the two siblings were able to fool those soldiers? How were you able to do that? Um, what convinced these soldiers that you, your younger sister and your two siblings were dead?
Từ khi nhập bản dây hai tha F As I just stated uh, it was about to rain and it dit, was about to get dark the and they did not have much time. So they actually did not uh, complete their job properly. En fait, le, if they were to do their job properly, they would drag us one by one and uh, finish us off if they were to make sure that every one of us uh, was dead. Achever, but I think they hurried to finish us off and uh, go to get our belongings where Ensuite, we parked up on the other side uh, of the street. So they never the buried question. you uh, and the others Et of the group? They terrible. never dug a pit? Uh, they just left you because they were afraid of the rain? Is that what you're saying? In fact, the pit was and uh, existing be 52 crater. No, la, la fosse, of course, un crater a lot of Cambodians are uh, familiar de with de that. De there were remnants de of B52 craters, and they were pretty large. That is, the, the top diameter was about 7 to 8 meters wide, and the bottom diameter was about 3 meters wide. The they did not cover us, fond, but they threw us Donc, into the pit and they put some tree leaves on top, tree leaves and tree branches on top of feuilles. us. And that's all. And they left the, the dead bodies Question. there. Uh, do you know if any dead bodies were found at that specific place afterwards? The skeletons, I mean? The rest of humans were found in this fosse by the suite. But he that sat up down at the no. I left the dead bodies there. Ils ont laissé les corps. And I did not know whether later fosse. on the pit was covered with earth or not. Je ne sais pas si but uh, during the Khmer Rouge regime, those sketches were filled with uh, skeleton remains, and time, sometimes uh, the cows. Uh, ate away the bones. Mr. Ritter, do you have an explanation for the fact that um, an organization called DC Chem uh, found only one mass gravesite in the West Zone, which is indeed Tre Rong Kla, which is 70 kilometers north of Wat Chirak Sedek? Mr. This, this is a police inspector, Mr. President. Your Honor, without, how can the witness possibly speculate on that unless he knows what areas DC Cam looked at, what they, uh, whether they were even mandated to search for all areas or only went to look for one particular site, asking him to explain why DC Cam only found or resumed one site. Uh, there's no way this witness could have information unless he worked for DC Cam on that project. Mr. President, this is a police inspector. Uh, it is my strong conviction that he is lying from A to Z. He is surely able to say uh, anything about mass grave sites uh, found by DC Cam. Monsieur le Président, si je... le Président si je peux me un commentaire. Depuis le début de cet interrogatoire, no, notre confrère nous parle du village de Ronkla qui serait situé à 70 km de la fosse dont parle le témoin. Nous n'avons aucune possibilité de vérifier cette information. Les documents sur lesquels se base notre confrère pour faire cette affirmation que ce village est à 70 km alors que le témoin disait que c'était à 2 km ne sont pas au dossier. Ne les présente pas. Nous n'avons aucun no moyen de vérifier qu'il s'agit bien du même village. Pour no à tout le moins savoir d'où so proviennent les informations qui permettent de dire aujourd'hui que ce village était à 70 km et non pas à 2 km. Merci, Monsieur le Président. Président, peut-être prendre un court cut, si je peux, avec la présidence, pour demander à l'invité une question. Are you aware of any exhumation sites of London soldiers or their families in the area? Êtes-vous au courant de sites où l'on aurait exhumé des soldats de l'Ontario et leurs familles?
dans cette zone. I am not aware of any exclamation. However, allow me to add that after 1979, the government made an appeal to the people if they knew any repeats where the skeleton remains were scattered so that the skeleton remains could be collected, gathered and stored at the provincial town hall. And that applies to all provincial town halls throughout the country. That is my recollection of the government's appeals and action in 1979. Did you uh, reply to this appeal by uh, leading to this place and trying to recover? The remains of your mother. Avez-vous cherché à retourner à cet endroit pour retrouver les restes de votre mère? Dans le cadre de cet appel. No, I did not go to that area. However, the government's appeal was for the people to gather the skeleton remains and store them at various areas. Museum or where they could uh, store and maintain the skeleton remains, and that applied uh, throughout the country. Thank you. Um, if I may respond to the civil party lawyers, I'm not relying on any document. I'm relying since 2015 on Google Maps, which clearly says that uh, Pray Long Kla is uh, 70, 65 to 70 kilometers north um, of Wat Shrak Sidek. So, um, let me withdraw the question. Mais je, écoutez, je retire ma question. President. Uh, lead caller for the civil party, please do not take turn uh, to uh, respond to each other. Bon, je demande and I believe your time runs out, uh, Defense Council. If you, do you have any further questions to be put to Lee's witness? Uh, yes, about a thousand, Mr. President. I have I need at least two more hours. Ten minutes is ridiculous. J'en ai au moins mille. Il me faudrait deux heures de plus. Dix minutes, c'est ridicule. Your Honor, perhaps the counsel could indicate what the most important question he has left, so we could at least give him a chance to ask the most important question he has left. If it has to go like this, I withdraw all my questions. Eh bien, si c'est comme ça, je retire toutes mes questions. President, now it's 26 past 10, and the chamber takes a break for 20 minutes. La chambre va observer une pause de 20 minutes. And upon our return at 10:46, we will give a floor again to the defence council. The floor, the chamber is now in recess. Suspension d'audience.